What's up and welcome back to another episode of Cooking with Sunny. Today we're making a beautiful rosemary sage salt with lemon zest and garlic. It's something I love dearly and I will be bringing up in many of my recipes and videos. So I'm gonna use Malden salt for this. You could use kosher salt or I don't, sea salt gets a little salty when you blend it for me, so I would stick with kosher or Malden. Got a cup of salt going in here. Next step is just gonna be to pick our rosemary. Just wanna take it off the stem and your hands are gonna smell like rosemary for the rest of the day. Trust me. Next step, we're just gonna pick our sage. You just want the leaves nice and easy. Just add your herbs to your salt. No need to chop them up. Cuisinart will do that for you. Now we're gonna add our garlic. You just wanna peel it. Use about three, four medium cloves in here. Just wanna cut up your garlic just a little bit. Add it into your Cuisinart along with the salt and herbs. Next step, we're gonna zest our lemons and put them in with the herbs and salt. I got a little, little trick for you here. Now when you're zesting a lemon, instead of just taking the lemon and zesting it like this, just hold the lemon, hold your microplane here, start at the top near the bottom of the microplane and just pull around. Going around the lemon, this is gonna get you, well, just a nice job of getting all the zest off. Just that first top layer. Pastry chef taught me this actually. Straight into your cuisinart. Remember guys, when you're zesting a lemon, just don't pull into the whites of the lemon. Just get that outer edge. As we all know, the whites are bitter. So there you go. Next step, we're just gonna blend up our salt. Might be good to pulse it a few times just to get it going. And let, let that run. So this has been blending for about 30 seconds. Sometimes that garlic will stick to the bottom corner. So just take a spatula or a spoon or whatever you have and just give it a good mix. Lid back on, we're gonna continue blending for about another minute. Okay, that's done. Let's have a look. Oh my God, it's like a beautiful, delicious green sand. Man, I can't wait for smell to come through TVs because this smells absolutely incredible. And the color is also amazing. So guys, this salt is gonna be something I bring up in a lot of my videos, a lot of the recipes. I mean, it's one of those things, poultry, lamb, beef, braising pork, potatoes, carrots. I mean, this is good on everything. Learn how to make this, keep it in your fridge. Never leave this out, it's gonna dry out because of the garlic and the lemon. You wanna keep it cold in your fridge in a Tupperware. Rosemary salt. And that's all for today, guys. If you like the video, please give me a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button below. See you next week.